All right, we're gonna learn how to remove the fuel shutoff rod that I've learned comes out the bottom. So we'll remove the screw. cap. Underneath there is the underneath here is a spring. And there is a small washer on top of the rubber. Okay, that's all that's holding it there. This is a one inch nut. Of course, the gas is drained. Hopefully it's loose enough. Not really loose enough, but... Well, if you missed it, the rod did come out of that hole, left the rubber bushing. And here is my certain to be original fuel rod spacer two washers and my problem is the seat does not seat in that valve. So we'll be replacing this.